Hi guys, my name is Alan Shaw and they are my partners. My name is Chiu Shan and my name is Kofra Ban. We are from SMJ Pages in Vietnam. First of all, I would like to introduce our project which involves in the topic of environmental. The amount of people who are suffering from mosquito-borne disease like Zika, Dengue, Malaria is happening every day and increasing every day. Based on the research we get from the Ministry of Health of Malaysia, there are approximately 54,000 of dengue cases in 2017 and 122 deaths. So, this is a serious problem that we cannot underestimate it. Of course, the authorities have carried out fogging activity to get rid of them. However, it is not only short-lasting but also harms to our body. It is because fogging meat contains of diesel, while diesel is also known as a carcinogen. Besides that, the Malaysians, which is also under the third class of pesticides, is also known as a sadly hazardous by the World Health Organization. Once sprayed, the concussions may will be inhaled and also be absorbed by the soil and water. This will result that our health and environment are affected. So, in order to overcome these all problems, we have come up with the idea of Lava Kilobot. Our Lava Kilobot is safe to use, no strong odor, long lasting, environmental friendly, biodegradable, and non toxic. The concept of our product is to kill the mosquito larvae efficiently. Besides that, we want to use environmental friendly, biodegradable, and easy obtain materials. We also want to make sure that it is safe to produce by the factories. To determine the suitable ingredients to make our lava kilo ball, we conduct three experiments. The ingredients we use are lemongrass, peppermint, rice straw, orange peel, basil, cypress urea, lemon peel, chili, garlic and pomelo peels. The aim of our first experiment is to determine the average lifespan of lava in different volumes of ingredients. So uh, this is our graph. This is our table. The aim of our second experiment is to determine the average lifespan of lava in different percentage of ingredients. This is our table. This is our bar. The aim of our third experiment is to determine the average lifespan of lava in different percentage of ingredients. This is our table. This is our graph. The conclusion of experiment 1, 2, and 3. We get to know that the suitable ingredients for our lava kiloball is pomelo peels, mandarin peels, lemon peels, garlic and by using these five ingredients, we are made into several types of salt, which are Epsom salt, potassium alum, and table salt. So, we found out that potassium alum grows fast and big. Epsom salt grows slower and shapes like needle that are brittle, while table salts can't grow well as it takes a long time to crystallize a small solid. Therefore, we decided to use potassium alum to produce our lava kilopore. After producing the product, we had carry out experiment 4 to find out how long can it last. So first, we set up a big track with 1.7 cm height so that it is only 1 degree just like in the drain. Second, we made a mass of the lava kilopore before being washed and put it on the big track. Third, pour one liter of water to hush the lava kilo ball and wait the mass after being washed. And lastly, wait the mass of lava kilo ball again until it is fully dissolved. So this is our result. From this table, we find out that a 30 grams of solid ball needed 30 liters of water to fully dissolve it. In experiment 5, we are going to make sure our lava kilo ball really works to kill mosquito larvae effectively. So we use the water that contains our ingredients which flow out after conducting experiment 4 to conduct our experiment 5. For that, out of 20, 19 larvae dies within 12 hours and only one larva dies in 20 hours. Our product is cost about 20 cents. I'm sure that it's worth and everyone can afford to buy it.
the future, we hope that we can collaborate with other factories to produce large amount of flour kilowatt so that everyone can get benefit from it. Besides that, we hope that we can help our government to kill the mosquito flour in a more effective way. Other than that, we also hope to improve its effectiveness by making it become more concentrated. As a conclusion, I would like to conclude that our lava kilowatt is cheap, can kill mosquito lava, long-lasting, environmental friendly, biodegradable and non-toxic.